the day Henry met a daffodil. <laughs> Hello, Daffodil. Hello, Henry. How are you today, Daffodil? I feel great, Henry. The sun is shining and the soil is lovely and tasty. Mm, yum, yum. Um, Daffodil, did you say tasty? Oh, yes, Henry. You see, plants like me get lots of special ingredients from the air and the soil and then use the sun to turn them into food. Wow, that's amazing, Daffodil. Oh, that reminds me. I have amazing news. There are some new plants moving into the garden tomorrow. Imagine all the new friends you're going to make. I know, Henry. I'm so excited. I finally have someone else to talk to. Well, other than Cloud, who sleeps all day. Never mind, Daffodil. Um, what's that noise? Special delivery for Mr. Daffodil. <laughs> Wait. There must be some kind of mistake. No time to chat. Must dash. Lots of deliveries to make. Have a nice day. Is everything OK, Daffodil? The plants have arrived a day early, Henry, and the gardener is away on holiday until tomorrow. But don't they need to be planted and watered straight away? That's right, Henry. If only there was a gardener around to help. That gives me a great idea, Daffodil. I could become a gardener and I could help plant all your new friends. That's a great idea, Henry. OK, first things first. Let's dig some holes so we can start planting this thirsty bunch. Hooray! Shovel and spade at your service. And don't forget me. Oh, Trowel, you're ever so cute. OK, team, let's get digging. Hello, Lilies. Hello, Henry. Hello, Poppies. Hello, Henry. Hello, Roses. Hello, Henry. <laughs> Done. <laughs> now that the plants are lovely and comfy in the soil, Henry, they need a drink of water. Water, water, need water. Right you are, Daffodil. Has anyone seen watering can? Here I am, Henry. But you're not going to believe what's happened. Follow me. Is everything OK? I'm ever so sorry, Henry. I feel like I've really let you down. What's wrong, Tap? It's my hay fever, Henry. My eyes are itchy and my throat is sore. But worst of all, my pipe is all blocked up. Oh. That means no water, Henry. And we still have thirsty plants to feed. What shall we do? Hmm. Oh, wait. I have an idea. OK, everyone. On the count of three. One, two, three. Cloud, wake up! Oh, oh who said that? Oh, what, what's happening? Where am I? I oh, oh, hello, everyone. Sorry for waking you up, Cloud. But we could really use your help. Oh, of, of course I'll help if I can. What is it? Well, we'd really appreciate it if you could do what rain clouds do best. And rain. Oh, it would be my pleasure, Henry. Oh, thanks, Cloud. OK, on your marks, get set, rain! <laughs> oh, there you go! Oh, oh, and let's not forget all of you! <laughs> thanks so much, Cloud. The plants are looking great. And now that you're awake, maybe you and Daphne could spend some quality time together. Oh, I'd like that. Me too. Hooray! The day Henry met a daffodil, he laughed along with everyone. The day Henry met a daffodil, he made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me Daffodil. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry. And thanks for helping with the garden. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye. Bye-bye. I'm coming, Mum. The day Henry met... A guitar! <laughs> Hello, 
Guitar. Hey, hi. How you doing, kid? I'm good, Guitar. How are you? I feel wonderful, Henry. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. That sounded brilliant, Guitar. Thank you very much. You must have millions and millions of fans all over the world. Well, trouble is, Henry, folk around these parts don't appreciate old instruments like us. They want to hear the cool modern instruments, uh, like keyboard and guitar over there. Oh, guten Tag, mein Fräulein. Oh, let's make party, yeah? <laughs> well, I think you are all cool, and I'd love to see you playing in concerts. By the way, when is your next show? All right. Uh, our next show. Well, you see, the thing is, Henry, we haven't played a show in over 40 years. Oh. It's not that we don't want to, Henry. Yeah, we'd love to. It's just, well, we don't have a singer, you see. That gives me a great idea, Guitar. I could become a singer, and I could join the band, and we could play a concert together. That's a great idea, Henry. And, uh, by the way, Nice outfit, kid. Thank you very much. Uh, is this on? Whoops, sorry. Don't you fret, Henry. You go on now and introduce yourself. We're all right behind you, kid. You'll, You'll do, do great, great Henry. Henry. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <coughs> go on, kid. I hope everyone enjoys the show tonight. Sorry, coming through. Don't mind me. Just say what you feel, Henry. Just say what you feel. Mmm, let's rock and roll. Woohoo! Yeah! You're the best, Henry! All right, Henry. I think it's time to introduce the band. Hmm? Okay, guitar. Right behind me, keeping everyone in time, is a one and only Beatastic. And to my right, he's only got four strings, but he'll hit all the low notes. It's a boom bastic bass. And last but not least, taking the lead is the six-stringed wonder, Guitar! <laughs> Henry, I think it's your turn. Oh, right. Good luck, Henry. Now sing your little itty-bitty heart out, kid. Uh, guitar, I know I probably should have mentioned this earlier, but, um, I've never actually sung in front of anyone before. I'm a little bit nervous. Don't you worry about a thing, Henry. Everyone gets nervous. Shucks, uh, even I get nervous from time to time. Just try your best, Henry. Because music is all about having fun. Thanks, everyone. Okay, here goes. To guitar. He laughed along with everyone. The day I met a guitar, he made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me, guitar. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry, and uh, thanks for performing with us. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye. I'm coming, Mom. The day Henry met a microscope. <laughs> hello, microscope. Ah, oh, hello, Henry. How are you today, microscope? I feel spectacular, Henry. I've just made a breakthrough. I think I found. What have you just found? Your socks, your car keys, your marbles. 
I think I've just found the cure for smelly burps. Wow! That means no more smelly burps. Can I take a look and see what it actually looks like? Of course you can, Henry. It would be my pleasure. Scientists use microscopes like me to see things that are really, really tiny. Like these molecules. Hello, Henry! Hello, molecules. <laughs> now, Henry, the contents of this Petri dish are very, very important. So, I'll just call my assistant to help us out. Well, did someone say they needed help? Uh-oh. Skeleton, what have I told you about running in the lab? That was the only cure I had made up. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. Well, maybe you can just make up a new batch microscope. I would if I could, Henry, but I didn't make it on my own. I had a scientist helping me. Oh, if only there was someone here to help me again. That gives me a great idea, Microscope. I could become a scientist and I could help you recreate that cure. That's a great idea, Henry. Okay, the first rule of science is experiment, experiment, experiment. And if that doesn't work, then you experiment some more. <laughs> Okay, Microscope, now let's recreate that cure. Hello, Blackboards. Hello, Henry. Hello, test tubes. Hello, Henry. Hello, flasks. Hello, Henry. I think this is it. I think we've done it. Well, well done, done, Henry. Henry. But how will we know if it works? Only one way to find out. <gasps> Stop, Henry. That's far too dangerous. You mustn't drink something if you don't know that it's safe. But if I don't do it, who will? What? Me? Really? Are you sure this is safe, Microscope? It's okay, Henry. He's made of plastic, aren't you, Skeleton? That's right. Don't worry about me, Henry, okay? Bottoms up. Is anything happening? I don't feel any different. Uh, 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 what? What is it? Why are you looking at me like that? Uh, uh. <laughs> it seems there are a few unexpected side effects to the new formula, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's back to the drawing board. Uh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, We've tried everything, Microscope. I think we should take a break, Henry. Skeleton looks pretty shaken up. <laughs> shaken up? That's it, Microscope. <laughs> Try this, Skeleton. <laughs> wow, that smells... It smells great. I can smell roses and lavender. I can smell fresh cut grass on a sunny day. Well done, everyone. We did it. We found the cure for smelly burps. <laughs> <laughs> the day Henry met a microscope, he laughed along with everyone. The day Henry met a microscope, he made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me, Microscope. I'd best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry. And thanks for helping me. You're welcome, Microscope. And have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye, Microscope. I'm coming, Mum. The day Henry met an aeroplane. <laughs> Hello, aeroplane. Are you awake? Aeroplane. Aeroplane! Oh, you're going to have to be louder than that to wake this big sleepy head, Henry. Aeroplane! Wake up! There's someone here to see you! Oh, um, um, aeroplane, ready for duty, sir. You can rely on me. Have a nice day, Henry. Hello, aeroplane. Oh, uh, hi, Henry. 
How are you today, Airplane? I'm fine. Harry, I feel great. You look a little tired to me. Tired? Me? Not at all. I was just resting my... Huh? What was that? Where am I? Who said that? Oh, I fell asleep again, didn't I? I'm sorry to say it, Airplane, but yes, you fell asleep again. Oh, who am I kidding? I can hardly keep my eyes open. This week I've flown to Japan, Australia and Brazil, and then back again. Twice. I really need some sleep. Just close your eyes, Airplane. There you go. I'm sure no one will wake you up. Airplane! Huh? What are you doing on that runway? There's a shipment of bongos that need delivering to the Congo. Now go, go, go! Oh, yes, sir. Right away, Control Tower, sir. Bongos to Congo. Got it. But Airplane, you can't stay awake. You really shouldn't fly. I know, Henry, but all the pilots are in the karaoke lounge. There's no one around. Oh, if only there was a pilot on board to keep me awake and fly me safely to my destination. That gives me a great idea, Airplane. I could become a pilot, and I could fly you and keep you awake. That's a great idea, Henry. Ladies, gentlemen, and bongos, this is Captain Henry speaking. Please fasten your seatbelts and prepare for takeoff. Good luck, Henry. Thanks, everyone. Well done, Henry. You're a... you're a natural at flying. Thanks, Airplane. But remember, you can't fall asleep. Let me think of a way to keep you awake. Oh, how about a game of I Spy? Oh, I love I Spy. Can I go first, please? Of course you can, Airplane. OK. I Spy with my little I, something beginning with G. Mm, is it gadgets? No. Gizmos? No. Gears? Glowing lights? Garden gnomes? No, no, and no. I give up, airplane. What is it? It's a great big storm cloud. It's a great big storm cloud! Keep your seatbelts fastened, everyone. Leave it to Captain Henry. Whee! Huh? Whee! <laughs> well done, Henry. Thanks, airplane. Yay! Hello, flock of birds. Hello, Henry. Hello, hot air balloon. Hello, Henry. Hello, helicopter. Hello, Henry. The airport is straight ahead, Henry. Prepare to land. Right you are, airplane. Landing wheels down. <laughs> OK, everyone, hold on. This could be a bumpy ride. Here we go. Keep it steady. Almost there. Touchdown! We made it, Henry. You are a great pilot. Thanks, Airplane. And we even got here on time to make our bongo delivery. Yay! That's my mum calling me airplane. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry, and thanks for being my pilot. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Bye bye, Henry. Bye bye. I'm coming, mum. The day Henry met a statue. <laughs> Hello, Statue. Hello, Henry. How are you today, Statue? Well, considering I've been stuck in this pose for 4,000 years, I'm feeling pretty sprightly. Ooh! <laughs> ah, much better. Statue, why does everything in here look so old? <laughs> That's because everything in this museum is old, Henry. Come along, I'll show you. This ancient Viking helmet dates back over a thousand years. Hello, Henry. 
These dinosaur bones are over 65 million years old. Hello, Henry. And how old is this rare, ancient, historical artifact? Is it 500 years old? 2 million years old? 10 bazillion years old? Oh, <laughs> that's not part of the museum display, Henry. That's just my old cassette player. He plays 80s music. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. Sometimes, Henry, archaeologists spend years looking for treasure. And once in a lifetime, they find something that's as beautiful as it is old. Behold, the ancient blue diamond. Mm, statue, there's nothing there. What? There's nothing here? Oh, no. The ancient blue diamond. Where's it gone? This is a catastrophe, Henry. Oh, wait! <laughs> My mistake! It says here it actually hasn't been found yet! <laughs> Silly me! If only there was an archaeologist around to help find it and we could gaze upon its elegant beauty! That gives me a great idea, statue! I could become an archaeologist and I could help find the ancient blue diamond! That's a great idea, Henry! Now, which way should we go? Hmm, one way will probably lead us to certain doom. And the other way will hopefully lead straight to the ancient blue diamond. This way or that way? Which will it be? I really think we should go this way. Why is that, statue? Because over that way, there is a great big boulder. And it's heading straight for us. Yikes! Run away! Hello, Sphinx. Hello, Henry. I'm very dizzy. Hello, Pyramids. Hello, Henry. Really starting to get dizzy now. Hello, Hieroglyphics. Hello, Henry. We have to hurry, Henry. The boulder is right behind us. I think I'm going to be sick. Oh, no. It's a dead end. Oh. Ah! Whoa. Just got to catch my breath. You two are fast. Sorry if I scourge you. I was coming to say hi, but you ran away and dropped your hat. Oh, you were just giving me my hat back. How nice. Thanks, Boulder. All that exercise did us good anyway. Boulder, do you know where the ancient blue diamond is? Oh, of course I do, Henry. It's right under your feet. Oh, hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Boulder. Whoa! You're welcome! Whoa! Finally, Henry, behold the ancient blue diamond. Wow, statue! You were right! It truly is beautiful. Oh, I bet you say that to all the ancient blue diamonds. <laughs> well, now that we've found you, would you like to come back to the museum and meet some of my new friends? Oh, I'd love to, Henry. Yay! The day Henry met a statue, he laughed along with everyone. The day Henry met a statue, he made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me statue. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry. Thanks for finding me, Henry. You're welcome. Have a nice day, everyone. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye. I'm coming, Mom. The day Henry met... A clock! <laughs> hello, clock. Oh, hello there, Henry. How are you today, Clock? I'm just splendid, thank you, Henry. My cogs are turning, my springs are springing, and my hands are going tick-tock, tick-tock. <laughs> mm, clock? Yes, Henry? What's that swingy thing in your tummy? Oh, <laughs> that swingy thing is my pendulum, Henry. A pendulum? What's that for, Clock? Why don't you see for yourself, Henry? Say hello, boys. Hello, hello Henry. Henry. <laughs> hello, everyone. 
I'm the pendulum, Henry. I swing backwards and forwards and keep the clock in time. Whee! Then the pendulum moves us cogs. And then we turn the hands, tick-tock, tick-tock. So people can tell the time by looking at my face. Well, but, um, what are you doing on the street? Well, Henry, I was supposed to be moving house today, but, um, there's been a problem. Oh, what's the matter, clock? The delivery van has driven off without me. So now I'm stuck here on the street and my housewarming party starts at four o'clock. What time is it now, clock? Tick-tock, tick-tock. It's just gone three. I was so looking forward to the party. Can't you just walk there? It's too far, Henry. I wouldn't make it in time. I'll just sit out here and hope another delivery van passes by. That gives me a great idea, Clock. I could become a delivery driver. And I could help deliver you to your new house in time for the party. That's a great idea, Henry. Oh, I can't wait to get to my new home and see all my friends again. What's the address, Clock? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> it's 21 TikTok Road. OK, Van, let's get going. Next stop, Clock's new house. Henry, before we drop Clock off, would you mind helping me to collect a few things on the way? Of course, Van. That sounds like fun. That's the spirit, Henry. But do remember, we must get to the party before the clock strikes four. Now, make sure your seatbelt is fastened and I'll take it from here. Here we go. Hello, piano. Hello, Henry. Hello, box of punting. Hello, Henry. Hello, disco ball. Hello, Henry. Phew. That's the last of the collections on board. Is everyone OK back there? Oh, yes, Henry. It's uh, lovely and um, cosy. <laughs> Don't worry. We're almost there. How are we doing for time? It's almost four o'clock, Henry. We need to hurry. OK, next stop, Clock's new house. Here we are, Clock. We finally made it. Your new house. Oh, thank you so much, Henry. You're welcome, Clock. Now, let's quickly get you inside. Oh, it feels so good to be here. I just can't wait to see everyone. Looks like we made it just in time. Oh, uh, where is everyone? Surprise! Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Henry. <laughs> what time is it now, Clock? It's party time! Today <laughs> 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 when we met a clock, we laughed along with everyone. The day when we met a clock, he made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me, clock. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry. And thanks for helping me get to my new house in time for the party. You're welcome, Clock. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye, Clock. I'm coming, Mum. The day Henry met... A light bulb. <laughs> Hello, lifeboat. Hello, Henry, my lovely. How are you today, lifeboat? Can't complain, Henry. The lovely warm sand beneath me and a beautiful blue ocean stretching out as far as the eye can see, drawing me in with her dulcet, watery tones. Lifeboat. Her waves gently lapping at the shore, beckoning me back into her salty embrace. <laughs> lifeboat. I can hear her soft voice dancing on the sea breeze whispering in my ear. Lifeboat, snap out of it. Henry wants to ask you a question. Oh, um, sorry. I was away with the mermaids there. <laughs> That's OK, lifeboat. I was just wondering, what makes you different from all the other boats? I rescue people who are lost at sea, Henry. So if someone gets into trouble, 
A lifeguard and I race out and bring them back to shore, safe and sound. Wow, that is so exciting, lifeboat. <laughs> Oi, I'm back here with my shell. <laughs> well, lifeboat, it looks like everyone is safe and sound. Help! Help! I think you spoke too soon, Henry. Is everything okay, Dolphin? The tide is coming in and there's a donkey stranded out at sea, Henry. Here. Uh, we need a lifeguard, quickly! Thunder and walruses, Henry. Dolphin's right. We need a lifeguard. If only there was one around. That gives me a great idea, lifeboat. I could become a lifeguard and I can help rescue Donkey. That's a great idea, Henry. Follow me. You'll be there in no time. Thanks, Dolphin. Hello, boy. Hello, Henry! Hello, Seagull. Hello, Henry! Ah! Hello, giant container ship. Oh, oh, hello, Henry! Donkey is just up ahead, Henry. Good luck. Thanks, Dolphin. Come on, lifeboat. Let's go! Uh. Ah. What was I thinking? Let's go sunbathing, I said. This will be the perfect spot, I said. Oh, I hope someone comes and rescues me. Hello, Donkey. We're here to rescue you. Oh, that's excellent news. Why have we stopped, Lifeboat? Sorry, Henry, but this is as close as a big salty sea dog like myself can go. We wouldn't want to run aground now, would we? I guess it's up to me now. But, hmm... How will I reach Donkey from here? Well, they don't call me a lifesaver for nothing, you know. OK, don't worry, Donkey. We'll have you safe and sound in no time. Uh, thanks, Henry. I was afraid no one would come to rescue me. But now you're here and everything's going to be just fine. Uh, help! Hurry! Quick, Henry. OK, here goes, everyone. Wish me luck. Good luck, Henry! Hee -haw. Hooray! Hee -haw. <laughs> now, Henry, all you need to do is pull Donkey in. I think I might have a better idea, Lifeboat. You are right back there, Donkey. Couldn't be happier, Henry. Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> Right, lifeboat. Back to dry land, please. Aye, aye, skipper. Day and we met a lifeboat. She laughed along with everyone. Day and we met a lifeboat. He made lots of friends and had so much fun. Henry! That's my mum calling me lifeboat. I'd best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry, and thanks for saving the day. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye. I'm coming, Mum. The day Henry met. A letter. <laughs> Hello, letter. Hi, Henry. How are you today, letter? To be honest, I'm a little bit nervous, Henry, but I'm really excited at the same time. Why is that letter? Oh, sure, letter has been posted today. We're very proud of her. Aren't we, Telephone? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, our little letter is going on her first trip into the big wide world. Mom, Dad, stop it. I'll be fine. Wow, travelling sounds so amazing. But it's really important you don't forget anything. Oh, Henry's right, Letter. What about the address? Do you have the address? If you don't have the address, you won't know where you're going. I have the address. It's right here, see? Oh, and you can't go anywhere without a stamp, you know. I have one around here somewhere. <laughs> Thanks, Stamp. Right, I think that's everything. You'd best be on your way, love. You don't want to miss the two o'clock post? The two o'clock post? But it's almost three. Oh, you've missed a post collection. What will you do now? 
Oh, if only there was a postman here to help. That gives me a great idea, Letter. I could become a postman and I could help deliver you myself. That's a great idea, Henry. Come rain or shine, I promise I'll deliver you on time. Woohoo! Hello, corner shop. Hello, Henry. Hello, bus stop. Hello, Henry. Hello, hedgehog. Hello, Henry. The sorting office is just up ahead, Henry. We'll be there in no time. Letter, what exactly is a sorting office? Follow me, Henry, and I'll show you. This is where letters and parcels from all over the world end up. Guten Tag! Konnichiwa! Good day, mate. Hello, everyone. And then we all get sorted in the mailroom. Come on, Henry, jump in. Letter. Hello, postman. Hello, Henry. Now, don't forget to fasten your seatbelt. <laughs> Will do, postman. Huh? Will do. <laughs> Thanks, postman. Here we are, letter. Now, all I have to do is post you through the letterbox. Woof, woof. Ah, a dog! Please don't slobber on us. What's the matter, Letter? Henry, everyone knows dogs and postmen don't get along. Don't get along? Nonsense. One of my best friends is a postman. I was just welcoming you into my lovely home. Thanks a lot, dog. Sorry. Not at all. Now, can I offer you a glass of cranberry juice with a splash of orange? I'm a fruity little number. Thanks for asking, dog, but I have a job to do. Well, Henry, that was some adventure. Travelling is always an adventure, especially when you have a good friend by your side. The day Henry met a letter, he laughed along with everyone. The day Henry met a letter, he made lots of friends. That's my mum calling me letter. I'd best be off. It was really nice meeting you. Oh, aren't you forgetting something, Henry? <laughs> of course. I still have to post you through the letter box. Thanks, Henry. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye, letter. I'm coming, mum. The day Henry met a panda. <laughs> Panda. Oh, um, hello, Henry. Is everything all right, Panda? Oh, I'm sorry, Henry. How rude of me. Everything's fine. In fact, everything is better than fine. Why is that, Panda? Did you finish your painting? Are you going snorkelling? Did you buy new roller skates? Better than all of those, Henry. My cousin from China is coming over for a visit. Oh, I can't wait to give her a big hug when she gets here. Wow, that's great news, Panda. I love it when my cousins come to visit. Delivery for a Miss Panda. Oh, that's me. How exciting. Do I look OK, Henry? You look lovely, Panda. I'll just pop it here, shall I? <laughs> oh, um, Chinese pandas are a lot browner, hairier and altogether sleepier than I expected. I'm not a panda. I'm a sleuth. Well, of course you are, but if you're here, then where's my cousin? I hope she's not lost somewhere in the zoo, panda. Oh, if only there was a zookeeper around that could help us look for my cousin. That gives me a great idea, panda. I could become a zookeeper, and I could help find your cousin. 
That's a great idea, Henry. Come on, everyone. Let's go. I'm right behind you. Looks like Sloth has fallen asleep hanging upside down. Sloth had a long trip, Panda. I'm sure he'll catch up with us later. Hello, Lime. Shh, Henry. I got my eyes on that lovely gazelle over there. You're it. Oh, Lion. You get me every time. Come back here, you. Um, Lion, gazelle. Have either of you seen another panda like me around? <laughs> Sorry, Panda. I haven't, I'm afraid. We've been too busy playing tag to notice anything. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Lion? Yes? You're it. <laughs> Come back here, you. Looks like this could be a long day, Panda. Zebra, have you seen any pandas today? Afraid not, Henry. I've been too busy finishing my painting. Hippo! Any chance have you seen another panda like me around today? Sorry, panda. I've been too busy snorkeling today. Hello, elephant. Have you seen any pandas like this one around today? No, sorry, Henry. I've been too busy on my roller skates. <laughs> what are we going to do, Henry? We've searched everywhere and there's still no sign of my cousin. Not quite everywhere, panda. Excuse me, signpost. Do you know the way to the sloth enclosure? Well, I most certainly do, Henry. It's that way. Thanks, signpost. Hello, Mummy Sloth. Have you seen any other pandas around here today? Pandas? Here? Today? I haven't, I'm afraid. Whoa. Are you okay, Cousin Sloth? Sorry about this, but my cousin arrived yesterday from South America. And he hasn't really got the hang of the whole sleeping whilst hanging upside down thing yet. Have you, Cousin Sloth? How many times do I have to tell you I'm not a sloth? I'm a... Panda, it's you. You've been here all along. The deliveries must have gotten mixed up. But if you're not a sloth, then where's my cousin? Here I am. <laughs> calling me panda i best be off it was really nice meeting you the pleasure was all mine henry and thanks for helping me find my cousin you're welcome have a nice day bye bye henry bye bye i'm coming mom the day Balloon. Hello there, Henry. How are you today, Balloon? I'm fantastic, Henry. You can't beat the life of a balloon. We're bright, colorful, and always the first ones invited to parties. <laughs> balloon? Yes, Henry? How do you float around like that? Is it magic? Oh, it's much better than magic, Henry. I'm filled with helium. Tell Henry all about it, boys. Hello. 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 Helium is an inert gas that floats around without much mass and has no color, odor, or taste. But us balloons, we think it's great. <laughs> I wish I could float around all day like you, Balloon. There's not much time for floating about today, though, Henry. It's the day of the big circus show. Me and the boys are performing on stage with the funniest, most amazing clown ever, aren't we, boys? We sure are. <laughs> I'd love to see a big circus show, Balloon. Well, we better get you a ticket then, Henry. One child's ticket, please, ticket booth. I can give you a ticket, but it won't be much use. I'm sorry to say, the show has been cancelled. Cancelled? The clown's tour bus has broken down and he can't make it to the show. Sorry. This is a disaster. How are we meant to put on a show without our star clown? That gives me a great idea, Balloon. I could become a clown, and I could help put on the show. 
That's a great idea, Henry. Balloon, I feel like I'm missing something. <sighs> Sorry I'm late. Ah, uh, that's it. Thanks, Nose. Hello, boys and girls. And snacks of all ages. <laughs> For my first clown-tastic trick, I'll need the help of my inflatable assistant. Balloon! Is that OK, Balloon? Of course, Henry. It would be my pleasure. What do you have in mind? Well, oh. Oh, uh, careful now. <laughs> that tickles. Ta-da! Oh, um, <laughs> woof, woof. <laughs> that was great, Henry. The crowd is loving the show so far. Whatever will you do next? Just you wait and see, Balloon. Hello, Cannon. Hello, Henry. Woohoo! Hello, trampoline. Hello, Henry. Hello, rings. Hello, Henry. Ta da! <laughs> wow, Henry. That was the best final act I have ever seen. That's not the final act, Balloon. Henry will now attempt the gravity defying tightrope walk of doom. Please do not try this at home. Safety nets at the ready! Here I go, everyone. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Yes, be careful, Henry. Mind your step. I'm so excited I could just push. We've got you, Henry. Thanks, everyone. Just drop me off up here, please. Ta-da! You did it, Henry. You made it across the tight rope, and you saved the show. Thanks, Balloon. But I couldn't have done it without your help. Now, anyone want a custard pie? <laughs> <laughs> my mom calling me, Balloon. I best be off. It was really nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine, Henry. Thanks for helping us put on a great circus show. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, Henry. Bye-bye. I'm coming, Mom. <laughs>